Ohio has a great diversity of spring wildflowers. We're in the eastern deciduous forest biome where the, in the spring there's just a profusion of, of wildflowers that come up in the spring showing a great display. There's a number of sites you can go to on state parks and nature preserves that have wonderful displays that start as early as late March to and last into mid-May. Clifton Gorge the Nature Reserve is a great wildflower display because of the different type of bedrock of dolomite and limestone, uh, calcium rich bedrocks. You have very high moisture content. Uh, the, the gorge has uh, kind of shelters of plants. And you can see on the slopes a number of species in a very small area. You can see 10 to 20 species of wildflowers. Mid April to early May is the peak season. That's when uh, the trilliums and a number of other species are in full bloom and there are several really common species. Uh, one of the ones that pretty much is, occurs in every county in the state of Ohio is the cut leaf toothwort. Uh, cut leaf toothworts in the mustard family has four petals. It has very sharp narrow leaflets. It gets its name uh, toothwort because of the tuber or corm is a, looks like a tooth and Pretty much any deciduous forest you go into, you'll find that species. Another one is spring beauty. Cut leaf two fort and spring beauty flower about the same time. Other common species is our large flower trillium, which is our state wildflower. Uh, it starts to bloom in mid-April. It's a great family activity to go out in the, in the spring and, and walk the trails and see the, the profusion of spring wildflowers. Uh, and it's a great learning opportunity for, for the family.